so hello dear student welcome back to this youtube channel and in this video we are just going to uh, print uh, something funny so let's start code and at the end of the video you will see how uh, it will work okay though first of all if we are doing as our c code then we will uh, type our basic thing i n c l u d include include and so uh, this time we are not going to type stdioh we are going to type conio dot h and uh, after that we are going to type our previous thing int uh, and main int main then this this thing and now we are going to open our curly bracket where, where we are going to code the first we are going to declare a variable known as int and this will be a comma b comma c we are declaring the three variables in the same line so don't be confused uh, these are three uh, different variable we can also create it int a uh, semi uh, int int b and then int c in a three different way so uh, now we are going to type our printf function and now tell me your digit tell me your digit d i z i t uh, the user will put any digit here and now we will uh, uh, look it like that and now we are going to add one slash n ok now we are going to uh, take the input from the user by scanf and in a scanf we are going to uh, the user is uh, putting any digit that means we are going to uh, store in a digit format so percent %d here now comma and this percent %d the value of percent %d uh, we are going to send it in a uh, int, int int a so we are typing a now we are going to declare uh, make a loop like uh, for for and then uh, we are going to uh, open our uh, bracket and we are going to define one thing that if uh, start b is equal to 1 okay now the b will be 1 uh, starting by 1 now in this here and now if the b is smaller than smaller than or equal to if the b is smaller than or equal to a and whatever the user is putting value then b uh, will be increased by 1 so we have to type b plus plus ok b plus plus now this is ok now open uh, this thing curly bracket and enter one more for uh, in this uh, loop ok now we are adding one more for and in this for we are going to declare c is equal to 1 c is equal to 1 and if the c is smaller than and equal to uh, equal to b uh, you will understand what we are doing uh, after the code is completed then c uh, increase c by 1 means c plus plus ok we have uh, done this now in this for we are going to uh, create uh, its own semicolon uh, sorry in uh, curly bracket that will be print uh, now we will type print print printf uh, and we'll uh, put any emoji like let's put it this emoji okay now uh, we are going to uh, end it in a next line and now it is print print printf and slash n slash n means it will uh, come in a next line okay and now we are going to type here g e t c h gets and this is uh, this one if you are uh, if you will type stdios then you have to type like return 0 but uh, just uh, understand it for this moment getch and hope you have understood what uh, we have done here and we will just in, uh, close it by this semicolon ok now run it uh, it is uh, errorless now we are going to put a digits 10 then it will uh, print this that emoji in a 10 row no, now you can do uh, some masti here by uh, putting some uh, emoji here and changing it to the next level and now we have put it uh, this kind of emoji and now run it let's see and we are just inputting the digit uh, we are putting 15 now it will print like this and the process completed and press enter so hope you have understood what uh, we have tried to made and you can just uh, use it uh, to form any digit like 0 1 0 1 0 1 in a row and this thing let's try it once like uh, remove this emoji and just type 0 1 and see uh, see what it will print now run it and enter 10 now see the magic 
it it uh, it is just like a uh, funny code and we can uh, use it to print anything so hope you have understood everything so see you in the next video till then take care and bye bye